Around Cleveland, brought to you by Spitzer Auto World. Life is hard, car buying shouldn't be. Hi everyone, I'm Donna Rucco and you're back on The List. We thought the polar vortex was over in March. Well, maybe we were wrong. Mike Brookbank has the crazy weather trends everyone's complaining about around Cleveland. At number one, this drastic dip in temps it's a change from the 80s has Clevelanders like six-year-old Alexis wearing long sleeves today. That is just crazy. It's not only annoying for fans of summer, it can actually impact our health. Your body is trying to conserve um, the heat. And to be able to do that, the blood vessels um, become somewhat more constricted. That increases the risk of blood clots, which can then lead to heart attacks. Just grab a light jacket and make your best plea to Mother Nature. Summer, get hotter soon. At number two, a Cleveland native is helping guide GOP hopefuls once they get to town. Writer Claire Malone's article in The American Prospect directs politicians to parts of the city where they'll find like-minded peeps. You can see Rand Paul rubbing elbows in Medina County. I'm just not very hungry anymore. That's bad news for New Jersey Governor Chris Christie. He might find supporters in the buffet line at Sokolowski's. As for parts of town, Republicans are likely to find protesters. Cleveland Heights, home to aging hippies, as well as Lakewood and Rocky River. At number three, the city's first creative reuse center is now open for business. We're saying, let's reconsider what we throw away and let's reconsider what we use to be artistic with. The Upcycle Parts Shop joins movements like Zero Landfill and Collective Upcycle in helping to build a sustainable Cleveland. The possibilities of what you can create at the art bar are endless. It's indestructible cardboard and pool noodles and you know, you can sort of like. Wow. Now you're caught up in Clued in Around Cleveland on Mike Brookbank. Around Cleveland, brought to you by Spitzer Auto World. Life is hard, car buying shouldn't be.